Hi, my name is Maggie Binkley. I'm an ACSM exercise physiologist. I'm a Beachbody coach, and I instruct turbo kick and pyo formats in the group fitness setting. So something happened to me this morning, and it was a big aha moment for me. I received a text in response to one I had sent a few days ago to a really good friend of mine who I have been coaching in health and fitness for a few years. Um, I, had, I had checked on her and hadn't heard from her for a few days, and she responded this morning and basically said that she felt like a failure. She seemed extremely discouraged and sad. Um, this is not something I'm ever okay with, but in particular, when it's somebody like this person who is a wonderful person, she has um, two very young children, she's a wife, so she's a mother, she's a wife, she has a full-time job, she works really, really hard. She takes care of her family. She's so good to her friends. And for somebody like that to say that they felt like a failure is just not okay. So this was my aha moment, but then it went further. And she said that she was afraid to lean on me. And um, this was my moment of sadness, but it also helped me to understand something. And that is that people are scared to lean on me is I somehow intimidate people with my exercise videos and pictures and stuff that I post on Facebook and social media. Um, somehow that's intimidating, somehow, to some people. Um, people also can see me as having it all together, which couldn't be further from the truth, honestly. Um, and then lastly, I believe that people are fearful that I'll judge them because they're not working out consistently or not eating um, as healthy as they could. So let me share something with you. I am just like you. I struggle some days to work out. I struggle to eat healthfully. My motivation isn't always there. I'm not a perfect eater, nowhere close. I've had issues all my life with this. It's a mind game for me. I love food way too much. And this isn't something that I've talked about a whole lot, um, but maybe that's something that needs to change and that you need to hear from me. And then lastly, you cannot be fearful that I will judge you. I wouldn't be in this business of helping people become healthier if I was going to judge them. You know, anytime that I see um, some kind of like light go off for somebody to want to become healthier, um, to eat better, to exercise, whether it's somebody talking to me or a post I see on social media or anything, I get really happy and excited. I genuinely want what's best for people and I'm not going to judge you based upon past choices you've made um, that were or weren't healthy. That's just not who I am. I followed a career into health and fitness because of my sheer love for all things exercise and nutrition. When you have something you love, you know you want to share it with people. You have something you love. You know how it is. You want to talk about it. You want to share it. You want to let people in on what it is that makes you tick, what makes you so what makes you so excited and that you're so passionate about. That's what this is for me. It's something that I really, truly love. So while I'm no means perfect or have it all together, I do have things that I can offer you. I genuinely care about your health and about your well-being. No matter who you are, I chose to take this path into this career because I genuinely care about helping people better themselves. The second thing is I can share my expertise with you from a professional standpoint. Um, like I said, I have an education in fitness and nutrition, or I have some professional perspectives that I can share with you. I can offer you my experience from a personal perspective. So like I said, I'm just like you. I struggle. I know that there's struggle in eating healthy and in motivating to go work out. I have those struggles too. And the last thing I know that I can help and offer you is something that I know many of you appreciate for appreciate me for already, and that is my positivity and my ability to motivate. Okay, that's why I love teaching group exercise so much. That's why Turbo Kick and Pio fall into my category of love to such high degrees is because in those hours of my day or one hour of my day, I get to express that motivation and look at you eye to eye 
and give you that positivity and motivation to tell you that you can get through this workout. But that's something that I can do and that I do do, do do, in all aspects of my health coaching. I just really want you to understand that I am here out of genuine care for you. I have chosen to take the path into Beachbody coaching in particular because Beachbody is all about helping end the trend of obesity. And that expands to beyond just obesity. It expands to becoming healthier, to being happier, to, um, you know, personal development is a huge piece of beach body and coaching and reading and making sure that you're constantly growing and developing your inner self, not just your outer self. It's all about becoming better and happier as a whole in your life. So that is what I'm here for, truly and honestly. And I just wanted to kind of get this video out there. Just reach out to me if you want. If not, that's okay. I'm not necessarily everybody's cup of tea, and I'm okay with that. So I hope you have an awesome day, and I hope to talk to you soon if you are at all inclined to reach out to me. Thanks for listening.